food supplements. Uh, you can refer, for example, here, like a uh, uh, growth market product category, national market for vitamin and dietary supplement, right uh, with uh, sale robust for nine to four millions, as a five to uh, five to seven million thousand four things. Okay, mana figure there? All right. Okay, so this report, uh, Hazana Research Institute, they have uh, they show some figures here, right? Uh, 2005 until 2014. So you can you can use the same figures. However, you need to update because today is already 2021. Your punya report ini up 2014. You think it's in the seven years left. How about current uh, scenario? So you can take this, uh, what do you call, report, right now you can put in into your uh, subsection introduction, right now, but you have to refresh, refresh, re statement, rewrite this statement using your own word and update figures, right now. So in the figures here, for example, Punya research from 2000 until 2014. 2014 to estimate, right? Huh? So this is the uh, forecast, right? Huh? Retail and sales of vitamin D supplement forecast, right? Huh? From 2014 until 2019. So your job is this happening. This report they refer to here, Euro Monitor International. So what you can do. Right now, you, you try the uh, website name, Euro Monitor International, and try to find the uh, report, right now, figures here. Because in this report, there are any estimations. Right now, there are forecast, 2014 and estimation. So you need to find uh, the figures. So you can use uh, the figures as the figures, uh, published figures, in your report. All right, eh? so ini adalah process replication. The same study, we conduct the same study. Right? However, this study, they are interested to know about traditional health supplements. Right? Eh? So we want, because as mentioned just now, this is the theme, health supplements. So the punya interest area for this research is they are only focused on traditional health supplements. Right? Eh? But in their uh, Introductions, right now, overview. We need this in the panel industry overview, right now. So, this is a uh, uh, you introductions, right? Huh? So, this is how this research start their story. Okay, this is crucial because this section, right now, introduce to us what are the issues this study interested to solve right now apakah isu apakah masalah yang hendak diselesaikan dalam penyelidikan yang dibuat oleh Khazanah Research Institute ini right now they concern on traditional health supplement however in their introduction they mention uh, overview so this is introduction right now general story about the theme right now so the theme so you can read for this right now you can use this uh, section but you need to rewrite in your own words, right? Huh? You can update the figures right now from here. So this is good example of that way we can start our research. So similar to other research, right now, yang, uh, yang orang lain buat, macam tu juga. Right now, you cari, this is kita panggil clipping. Right now, clipping, clip. Right now, information that you clip right now from the, uh, from this, uh, what they call, we can trust the sources, all right, eh? statistic Malaysia, right, eh? kalau ada, okay, kalau yang macam, macam ni tadi kan, all right, eh? so Hazana Research Institute, eh? uh, the sources that we can trust, sometimes they are, okay, for example, ResearchGate, ResearchGate ini, 
Uh, that is the Katapa where the people uh, pack their paper, their report, and etc. So you can find here, right? Uh, but uh, you need to read, right? Uh, and try to get the original sources. For example, this Kazana Research Institute, right? Uh, they punya data, intro, introductory data, they call it introductory data, data pengenalan. Right, yeah, dia memberi perkenalan kepada dia punya isu atau masalah. Right, yeah, they are cited right, yeah, from Euromonitor, uh, Euromonitor International. So in your research, right, yeah, in your writing, in your write up, right, yeah, don't cite Hazanah Research Institute. You need to uh, cite, right, yeah, uh, C-I-T-E, cite. You need to cite the original sources. Okay. Right, huh? So I mentioned that right, huh? this data, they get 2014. So your job is to uh, update right, huh? the data. See? Uh, see, ini yang saya maksudkan. Right, huh? uh, health supplement is a very general issue. Jadi itu hanya sebagai tema sahaja uh, that we pick for this research. So in detail, right, huh? uh, when we talk about vitamin dietary supplement, yeah, the vitamin, Ya, yeah, the herbs, right now, nah, non herbs, right now, nah, dan sebagainya. Right now, nah, ada orang ambil vitamin untuk kecantikan, untuk putih, putih, kan? Right now, nah? uh, untuk kehitam, kehitam, whatever things. Right now, nah, there's a second category for beauty, right now, nah, for health, uh, for uh, dietary, dan sebagainya. So you can read. Other example, right now, nah, so this is a statistic. Right now, statistic. This is uh, the international uh, website. Right now, you can find uh, that uh, you can use. Right now, uh, you can cite the information right now, from this website. Statistics. Right now, for example, uh, dietary supplement. Right now, in Malaysia, July 2017 by group. Right now, you can use here. Right now, you can start your stories using the statistic you can find from this website okay so this is also hang on kalau you nak uh kata apa data yang lebih detail you have to pay but for you you can use this basic information right now in your introduction section introduction section and uh background of the study 1.1 1.2 okay so Ilmu riset, right, nah, ada ada juga sumber-sumber lain nah, yang related, right, nah, protein market, right, nah, you are you study, uh, you are focus on what they call protein supplement used by those those who are gym goer, right, nah, those uh, uh, apa dia muscles, right, nah, dan etc. They are attacking the proteins uh, supplements. Right now, huh? so maybe you are uh, interested to know right now huh? why people take a protein at that supplements. Right now, huh? so to start your story, to start your report, introduction part, right now huh? you can cite right huh? information from the worldwide, right now, huh? then specific to the Malaysia. Right now, also can do. Okay, so there are a lot of stories they can put in. Right, yeah. Yang lain-lain ini also you can find if you interested to do some comparison probably on the global survey. Right, yeah. you can put that. Okay. Okay, sir. All right. So another thing. Uh, 
on the last class, I did uh, ask you to share for today, for today's discussion, on the six steps, right? Uh, on how we are, uh, buddy, we, we uh, identify the the problems right now uh, in our study, right now. Uh, daripada you punya uh, introductions, study then introduction and background of the study, right now. Uh, after that when you start to identify what uh, what your research objective and results are. Uh, so it goes to into these uh, six steps. Step one, right now, discovering the issues. Right now, as I mentioned, how we discovering the issues? Right now, we, uh, perhaps that we identify the things. Right now, just now, the example, the theme is food supplements. So in the subsection 1.1 and 1.2, right now, uh, introduction and background of study, right now, you tell your story about the themes, right now, the theme that you, how you discover the issues, right, the clipping, the news that you get, uh, the statistic, the data, right now, and etc. Kalau tak ada statistik pun okay, right now, maybe you find daripada uh, uh, menteri, Right now, they open the akbar from the news. Right now, indicate that the importance of that uh, uh, particular area and etc. Right. So after you finding the issues, right now you list out. Right now, profiling main issues into sub area. For example, study. Right now, the food and supplements. Right now, how where uh, how you profiling the uh, the area? Right now, when we talk about the food supplement, people talk about uh, dietary supplement, uh, health supplement, beauty supplement, dan sebagainya. After that, you specify right now your what area that interests you. Right now, for example, I just want to know about the uh, health supplement. Right now, I didn't look into dietary. Right now, but we just just want to see the general, general health supplement. Uh, orang ambil vitamin B, vitamin E, multivitamins, dan sebagainya. Right now, some uh, health people yang sekarang ni, uh, they also apa ni the supplement that can help to boost your uh, your brain ability. Right, huh? uh, what they call prebiotic, uh, something like that. Right, huh? vitamin D, E, dan sebagainya. Right, huh? multivitamin is good to take by the students, and that's why. Right, now maybe my interest area, I want to know that what kind of food supplement taking among the students. Right, now university student, for example. Uh, that way I specified my interest. Right, huh? I want to know about the specific area, right now, uh, maybe uh, what uh, types, right now, I just want to know, right now, uh, just want to know what types of, uh, uh, what do you call, uh, food supplement uh, that taking uh, among students, uh, university students, right now, so then where I specify my interest. So you develop your research questions and objective. So, up to this uh, level, right now, sampai sekarang ni, you just, you can write your tentatively, right now, your general research question and general objective. Right now, the next step, when you when we are reviewing the literature, then we can find uh, the theory that we are going to test, then later you can uh, specify your uh, specific research question and specific objective. Right, and then you need to uh, justify right, uh, your objective, accessibility of the objective. Uh, and again, I like to repeat here. Right now, give your example. Right now, uh, this is a very good example. Clear. Right now, uh, so there is an issue green supply chain. So in your introduction part, right now, uh, they treat the story. Right now, talk about general supply chains. Right now, uh, probably if you uh, interested to know about general supply chain in Malaysia, so introduction part is the supply chain in Malaysia. 
uh, uh, profiling, right now you can find uh, uh, the area that probably people do research regard, in regard to green supply chain. And another tips, right now, how can we profiling, right now you pergi ke Google Scholar, right now you just type in green supply chain, right now, so they are a lot they are going to give you the list of the previous study on the green supply chains, right now. So then you know that, right now, then you can profile, right now, your issues. What area that people do research, right now, uh, on the green supply chains, uh, thing, right? After that, you profiling, then you uh, specify, right now, the pada banyak profile di situ. Right now, uh, uh, which area that you're interested in? Okay, then uh, you uh, uh, research questions and research objective. Right now, yang saya maksudkan tadi kita ada uh, main questions and this is the specific research questions. Similarly, for objective, we have main objective, we have specific objective. So up to this stage. Uh, I just expect you can uh, just write out, uh, write down that tentatively your main objective. Right, uh, sebab ini, benda yang di test ini, kita belum tahu lagi. Right now, we have yet specified a uh, specific area that we are going to test. Okay. So, this, to find out the specific objective and the specific business questions is guided Right, uh, by the theory, uh, your conceptual framework. Right, that conceptual framework is built right uh, after you review the literature. Okay, so this is how you you uh, justify your interest on the study. Okay, Professor Good. Yes, sir. Uh, Professor Good. Any questions? So far, no question. So far, no question. Uh, any group want to share their uh, figure? You can click there 